Using GG Git Locale in a script to automatically handle multiple languages makes it more dynamic and user-friendly. Instead of prompting the user to manually choose a language, the script can automatically adapt based on the device's language settings. The script starts by retrieving the device's current locale setting using GG Git Locale. This function returns a string representing the device's locale, such as English, Spanish, French, or any other language that the current device set as main. The script defines a set of actions for different languages. Each action displays a menu in the appropriate language using ggalert. Language actions is a table where each key represents a language code, and each value is a function that displays a menu in that language. Locale sub extracts the first two characters from the locale string, which correspond to the language code. The script displays the full locale string to the user using an alert. This provides feedback to the user about the detected locale. Finally, the script checks if there is a defined action for the detected language code. If a matching action is found, it is executed. If not, the script defaults to English. Language Actions checks if there is a function for the detected language. Language Actions, N, is used as a fallback if the language code isn't found. When creating a multi-language script, it is often better to automate language selection based on the user's device settings rather than requiring manual choices. This approach ensures that your script is user-friendly and automatically adjusts to the user's language preference without requiring manual input.